hello everyone and welcome back to our channel this video is a tutorial on how to make an e-commerce website for free with payment gateways so in this video we're going to create an e-commerce website for free and then we will show you how to integrate a payment gateway in it so let's begin there's a lot going on in this video make sure you're watching till the end let's start with the first part of this video which is creating an e-commerce website for free as you can see, we are on Google Sites, which is nothing but Google's own site making platform. So it's very easy to sign in into this Google Sites. Just log in with your existing Gmail or create a new Gmail account and sign in to sites.google.com. When you sign in, this is where you'll land up. And you can see that there are a few templates over here. So based on what you're going to create, you can choose a template over here. But you can see that none of them are related to e-commerce. Yes, that's the major disadvantage of Google Sites. They do not have or support e-commerce websites. So you cannot create an e-commerce website on this platform. But what you can do is create a website and then integrate a payment gateway into that website that you're going to create on this platform. How you're going to do that? Well, let's start. The first part is to create an e-commerce website. For that, we're going to go ahead with the blank template, which is right over here. So just click on it. Now you'll land up on the editor page, which has the website on the left side and then the tabs insert pages and themes on the right side. First of all, let's name our website. So we're going to name this as Fashion Hub. And over here, we're going to give it a title. Now you can adjust the size and alignment with all the options over here i'm just going to drag the blue dots and center align it you can change the theme for the website by going to the themes tab and you have a couple of them over here we're going to go ahead and stick with the simple theme now let's add a background image or a cover image over here that matches our e-commerce theme which is fashion so for that just go to change image you can either upload an image of your choice or go ahead and click on select a pop-up window will open like this. Now you can select from the gallery if you can find something that suits your need. What we're going to do is go to the search tab over here and type in fashion. This is nothing but your Google search. You will end up with image results. I'm going to go ahead and select one of these images. I'm going to select this one and click on select. So that is our home page. If you go to the pages tab, you can see this is the home page. Now let's go ahead and add another page which is our products page because we're creating an e-commerce website right so we need a page that displays all our products for that just go to this plus icon and select new page we're going to name this products and you can see the products page has been created now to make it easy for our visitors to reach our products page i suggest creating a button over here that leads them to the products page for that you can go to the insert tab over here and go ahead scroll down click on button and let's name this button shop now we need to link it to the products page so you simply select products over here so it's going to be linked to the products page and there the button is now you can decide where the button goes on the page i'd like it to be right on the top over here so if someone's going to click over here they're going to go to the products page now our products page is pretty much empty because we do not have products posted over here because that's not allowed on Google sites. So how are you going to do that? For that, you need this tool, which is called Power. So it's P-O-W-R dot I-O. It is a website for apps, like you can integrate apps into your website. Now to get started over here, you simply need to click on sign up for free. You can sign up with your Facebook or your Google account or use your email address. We're going ahead and signing up with Google. So once you've signed in, you'll be taken to the dashboard on Power and this is how it will look like. So our aim over here is to integrate payment gateways into our e-commerce website on Google Sites, right? For that, we need to create an app. Go ahead and click on Create New App. It'll take you to this page where you've got all the apps that are recommended for you. We need to search for something that says e-commerce so go ahead and search for e-commerce and there it is so this is what you need click on get app let's move this out of the way and now this is our app this is how we're going to integrate payment gateways in our google sites e-commerce website now let's just name it first of all 
as fashion hub because that's the website name now you have on the left side the connect tab where you can configure payments so you can connect your stripe enable uh, paypal payments or enable in-person payments which is nothing but cash on delivery option that you've got the configure notifications tab where you can configure notifications like send submission notifications and then we have the content tab so over here you can see these are the products and that's what is visible over here we're going to go ahead and delete these products because i'm going to show you how you can add one from scratch that's exactly what we're going to do so just go ahead and click on add product now let's add all the information for this product let's click on info and type the product's name i'm going to name it blouse you can enter a description as well for it let's say the button text what should it say let's say it should uh, it can say add to cart you can enable inventory tracking which means that if a certain product is out of stock then it'll show over here if you are selling a digital product then you can enable this now let's go to the plans and pricing what is the price that you want to sell this at let's keep it 25 dollars require shipping address let's turn that on shipping price if you want you can add it over here then you can choose whether this is a one-time purchase or a subscription and also allow the buyer to choose quantity and set the default quantity to one so these are the certain settings under the plans and pricing we can click on done here and you see this is the product now let's go ahead and edit it so for that we need to add an image first of all click on add image and then what you can do is search in the stock images for blouse and i'm going to go ahead and choose this one and you can see it has come over here now in this options tab you can add option groups let's go ahead and add an option group for sizes so we're going to add for size and let's go ahead and add the options for the size. For that, you need to click on option. Let's name this size X. Then we're going to add one more size, which is M. And we're going to add another size that says L. So three sizes for the blouse. Now, say in case uh, one of these products, like say for the large size, you need an extra charge because it needs more cloth, right? So we're going to add that over here and I'm going to show you how that works. So let's just set it now first and then we'll click on OK. So we have our first product done. Let's go ahead and click on publish because we have our product ready. Let's go to embed with code. This is the code. Just click on copy code. Don't worry, you don't need to learn coding or anything. It's simply a copy paste process. So we're clicking on copy code over here. The code has been copied. Now let's go back to our Google Sites over here and what we're going to do over here is go to the insert tab on the products page and over here you're going to click on embed. Now just go to this tab which is embed code and paste the code over here. Then you click on next and then you click on insert and then you can see that this box has been added over here. This box is nothing but what you created on power.ai. Now you can drag this box just so that everything is visible. So we have everything visible now. So the more products you add back in the power tool, the more you can expand it over here and the more products will be visible on your Google Sites e-commerce website. Now everything has been saved. Let's go ahead and publish. Give it a name and then click on publish. Now, once your website has been published, just click on this drop down arrow over here and go to view published site. And this is your website. So this is the home page that we designed. And if we click on the button that we designed, we'll be taken to the products page. And here you can see our product. Now, if you click on add to cart, you have these different options in the size. And this is what I said the extra money will be added here. So if a customer selects the L size, their total will change with the added amount. So this is how you can create an e-commerce website for free and integrate payment gateways into it. With that, we complete this video. We truly hope it has benefited you. 
do let us know your thoughts in the comment section below we'll catch you soon in our next video till then stay tuned and stay subscribed